wife 41f stopped communicating with me 50m and our daughter 8f before a vacation almost no contact since then what should i do story my 50m wife 41f got upset with me and our daughter 8f and stopped talking to us for a full day she didn't even say goodbye before our trip so i was about to take my daughter to a theme park for a few days my daughter was being particular about what clothes and shoes to bring as she's been lately and responding in a frustrated and impatient tone it went like this my wife suggested you should take these shoes and my daughter responded no i want those i don't like these my wife said those are dirty you can't take them to which my daughter retorted you always make me take the ones you want not the ones i like similar arguments happened over the clothes my wife came to me frustrated with our daughter's attitude normally our daughter is very well behaved but lately she's been having these moments especially around choosing clothes even if my wife lets her choose she finds a reason to argue i told my daughter in front of my wife that it's never okay to talk to mom or anyone else that way no matter what i explained that we should always speak respectfully and it's okay not to like the clothes but it's not okay to express it in that tone my daughter apologized to my wife then my wife turned to me and said i don't understand why she always talks to me like that she doesn't always do it just sometimes and she usually apologizes afterward i made the mistake of telling my wife that she sometimes speaks to our daughter in a similar frustrated tone saying things like i've told you a million times and you never do it right and that this might set the tone for their communication I told her that while our daughter was wrong to speak that way, it might help if she worked on creating a more positive way of communicating with her. My wife got very upset and stopped talking to either of us. I tried to talk to her about what was wrong, but she said to both of us, it's clear you both don't care about me, so I won't talk with you. Don't talk to me anymore. I was shocked. I didn't expect her to react so strongly. She didn't talk to us for the rest of the afternoon, didn't say goodnight to our daughter, and stayed in bed with her phone the next morning while we were getting ready to leave. My daughter, who was now hesitant to talk to her, still tried to say goodbye by going to her bed and saying, Mom, we're leaving. My wife looked up briefly but then just went back to her phone. So, we left. It's been three days. Yesterday, after crying a bit, my daughter told me she missed her mom. She was sad that her mom didn't hug or kiss her. Goodbye. And asked if she could message her. Of course, I said yes, and she FaceTimed her. My wife answered and spoke as if nothing had happened. Hey, sweetie, having a good time? My daughter asked. Uh, yeah. Are you okay, mom? My wife replied, I'm feeling a bit down because it's raining, and I can't go to the restaurant I wanted. At that moment, I was. Well, after what happened, after two days of silence, our daughter calls her, and all she says is she's down because of the rain? Maybe she didn't know how to express that she was feeling sad and just said what came to mind? I mean, what is going on? Anyway, my daughter said, I didn't like how you got upset the other day, and my wife responded with a simple, oh, yeah. My daughter then said, I want you to tell me you're sorry. I was surprised she said that. My wife replied, I'm sorry. My daughter then said, okay, mom, talk later, and they ended the call with a bye, have fun. That was yesterday. Today, my daughter sent a few messages like, hey, mom, we're in line for this ride, and, hey, mom, it's so hot today, which my wife responded to as if everything were normal, oh, good, did you like that place, and, remember to drink more water. Now, I'm feeling lost, frustrated, disappointed. I'm pretty sure that when we get back, she'll act like nothing happened, and if I bring it up, she'll say, you two are just being too sensitive, I'll say sorry if it makes you feel better. So, I'm sitting here on the floor of a hotel room, my daughter on the bed, and not a word from my wife except for her replies to our daughter. By the way, normally, my wife would be constantly messaging me, asking for pictures, asking to FaceTime whenever we could, asking our daughter to tell her everything about her day. And this isn't the first time something like this has happened, and quite frankly, I'm tired of it. So, do I just ignore her? As in, she didn't want me to talk to her, right? Well, I won't, unless it's necessary, to see if she finally realizes that words have consequences. Or should I tell her that what she did was unacceptable? She made our daughter very sad for a few days just because I suggested she work on improving her communication with her? I swear, that's all I said. I'm not really seeing many options right now, I'm just disappointed. And frustrated, really frustrated. Even though I'm enjoying the theme park with my daughter, I'm thinking about making some serious changes in my life. So, that's the situation. Any advice? By the way, English isn't my first language. I don't think I made any serious grammar mistakes, but I might have misused some expressions. Edit. My wife didn't come with us because she doesn't like theme parks. Both my daughter and I would have preferred for her to come and enjoy it with us, but we understand that she doesn't like it, so we decided to go by ourselves. Everyone was fine with that. In the afternoon, when we were packing, the three of us did it together. We only had two small backpacks. I packed my clothes, toiletries, umbrella, for the sun, and other items. It took us about 10 minutes. Some comments assumed my wife spent the whole afternoon packing while I was just watching TV or something. That's not the case, I don't like watching TV. Sorry, bad joke. Edit 2. So many comments are saying, my mom was exactly like that. I had no idea this kind of behavior was so common. I'm so sorry for those of you who had to grow up in that kind of environment. I'll make sure my daughter doesn't have to. I'm pretty sure my wife can change and never repeat this.